This is Nigeria in 1910, and this, around 130 miles southwest of Lagos, is Ife. This man is Leo Frobenius, one of the most famous German ethnologists. The local inhabitants lead Leo towards a small sacred forest. Rumor has it that within there is a beautiful ancient sculpture of a water god. Look, here at the foot of a tree, Leo Frobenius discovers a metal sculpture with a man's head and thin stripes covering its face. Leo is struck by how realistic the figure is, and in particular by the way the hair has been worked. For our ethnologist, it's quite simply impossible that this figurine be the work of local artists. Frobenius is convinced that only Greek artists, somehow lost in the Gulf of Guinea during antiquity, could have made such a finely crafted object. He ultimately gives up his wild theory. The Ife heads are well and truly the work of an African civilization that had nothing to do with the Greeks. Frobenius' discovery did at least draw attention to Nigeria's rich history.